You know, just sort of in a kind of a related but somewhat lighter uh, note, Sam Brinton, you will all remember him, the non-binary activist who was tapped by Joe Biden for the role of managing the United States' nuclear waste before he was fired for allegedly stealing luggage all over the country. Well, remember this one. He has been arrested again Wednesday night as a fugitive from justice for allegedly stealing luggage. Um, what's the latest on this? But also, you know, how does somebody like this wind up with a security clearance at a top nuclear job? James, there are a lot of strange people in the Biden administration. Sam Brinson, obviously, <laughs> one of the strangest. He's a guy. He's bald. He wears red lipstick. He's got a mustache. He he wears women's clothes. He's a nuclear engineer. He certainly could afford to buy his own dresses and women's underwear, but for some reason he prefers to steal them. So we know of at least three instances where he has been in airports and he's gone to the, you know, the carousel where they where the baggage comes out and he'll watch for like a, a pink piece of luggage, you know, <laughs> something that's obviously a woman's suitcase and he'll steal it. He'll pick it up like it's his and walk out with him. He's done this at least three times that we know of. One of them in my hometown airport, just a few, a few miles <laughs> from my home here in uh, in Minnesota. And, and then he'll wear these women's clothes that he has stolen from the airports. And for some reason, you know, this is his preferred way of getting, of getting women's clothes. He's done it at least three times that we know of. He's now been kicked out of the Biden administration. James, even the Biden administration has some limits. I guess we should take this as a, uh, a glimmer of optimism. Well, John Heinrecker, I think we have to take our hope and our little shafts of light from heaven wherever we can find them. Thank you so much for joining us here.